It's really important to bring in multiple disciplines to solve the really complex problems that we're facing in health today. The way to do innovation is to do it as a team sport. And NC State is in a very good position to make a strong impact in healthcare. If you're going to be on the leading edge of something, you, it's going to take more than one brain to do it. It's going to take a lot of brains. Uh, the Product Innovation Lab is uh, an innovation, I think. It's uh, design, engineering, and management. Uh, bring all those skills together uh, like you would in a company where you have real dollars at stake and uh, create something that ultimately has a good chance of being successful in the marketplace. There is the technical analysis, there's a business case that is made, and finally design, which gives form to the various uh, inputs that are taken from the other disciplines. It's very hard to teach how to uh, operate successfully in a very uncertain and risky environment. Our educational objective is to get students to build capability, to become more innovative, so when they go out in the work world, they can do it with their companies, with their organizations. Affordability, manufacturability, design, that all comes together in a real world scenario. So the students realize that bringing a product to market is not just a simple matter of uh, sitting at one's desk, but it's a very action-oriented kind of activity. They eventually, somewhere in the middle, hit frustration and uncertainty and confusion, and we design it that way because that's where the learning happens. We're very proud to have been acknowledged by Forbes magazine as one of the top 10 uh, innovative business school courses in the United States. Real world, challenging. Creative chaos, I guess, comes to mind. It's, it's very chaotic because you have a lot of uncertainty. It's complex and it's rewarding. Unique opportunity for learning. Transformative. It truly is for the students. The uh, final outcome is really something that's uh, uh, quite extraordinary. It's the way to get the students very well prepared for the experiences that we don't, we don't know what they will be yet, but they'll be prepared for anything.